restaurants across the Central Coast face dark days during the pandemic. But as Action Newgate reporter Ariana Hasso tells us, many of those businesses have made a full recovery. She joined us live in studio with details. Ari. Caitlin, that's right. And it's really great to see that after over a year of hardships, businesses on Monterey Fisherman's Wharf are finally feeling optimistic. Back and better. That's how some restaurants on the Monterey Fisherman's Wharf describe their comeback following the COVID-19 pandemic. Yeah, the numbers have fully recovered. We're, we're doing business absolutely comparable to 2019. When you compare pre-pandemic numbers to what we're doing now, it's been amazing. Luckily for some restaurants like the old Fisherman's Grotto, they didn't take too hard of a hit. And part of it is thanks to the in-state tourism. The business has been terrific. Uh, we get people coming in from the Central Valley, Sacramento, and the Bay Area. And domestic tourism for our area has just been great. But like many restaurants and businesses, the Raw Fish Harbor Grill faced challenge after challenge. They began renovation right before the pandemic hit, and it's been a constant adaptation since. Through we were closed, then we did only outside, then we did only take out, and then back inside, then back outside. Well, after 18 months of renovation that was extended about eight months because of the pandemic, we couldn't get permits, we couldn't get some, uh, materials. Uh, work shut down several times. But they not only survived, they prevailed. But everybody came back together, and I was so impressed where the, our, our chef and our general manager put a, not only a full crew back together very quickly, but a real quality crew. Businesses are predicting an even stronger recovery with the reopening of U.S. borders this week and the return of international travelers in the coming months. Caitlin, back to you. Thanks, Ari.